Chapter 21, To Be Ungrateful to One's Husband, and Disbelief is of, Different Grades, Lesser or Greater, Degrees, Narrated I B N Abbas, the Prophet peace be upon him, said, I was shown the hellfire and that the majority of its dwellers were women who were ungrateful, it was asked, do they disbelieve in Allah or are they ungrateful to Allah he replied, they are ungrateful to their husbands and are ungrateful for the favors and the good, charitable deeds, done to them. If you have always been good, benevolent, to one of them and then she sees something in you, not of her liking, she will say, I have never received any good from you. Chapter 22 Sins are from ignorance and a sinner is not a disbeliever unless he worships others along with Allah as a wajul. Narrated al marar at Arabad I met Abidar who was wearing a cloak, and his slave, too, was wearing a similar one. I asked about the reason for it. He replied, I have used a person by calling his mother with bad names. The Prophet said to me, O oh Abu Dar, did you abuse him by calling his mother with bad names? You still have some characteristics of ignorance. Your slaves are your brothers and Allah has put them under your command. So whoever has a brother under his command should feed him of what he eats and dress him of what he wears. Do not ask them, slaves, to do things beyond their capacity, power, and if you do so, then help them. Chapter 22 And if two parties or groups, from among the believers fall to fighting, then make peace between them both. Allah has called them believers. Narrated al Anif bin Qais, While I was going to help this man Ali ibn Abi Talib, Abu Bakr met me and asked, Where are you going? I replied, I am going to help that person. He said, Go back for I have heard Allah's messenger peace be upon him, saying, When two Muslims fight, meet, each other with their swords, both the murderer as well as the murdered will go to the hellfire, I said, O oh Allah's messenger peace be upon him, it is all right for the murderer but what about the murdered one Allah's messenger peace be upon him, replied, he surely had the intention to kill his companion. Chap 23 R. Dalm, wrong, of one kind can be greater or lesser than that of another. Narrated Abdullah, when the following verse was revealed, it is those who believe and confuse not their belief with wrong, worshipping others besides Allah 6, 83, the companions of Allah's messenger peace be upon him, asked, who is amongst us who had not done injustice, wrong, Allah revealed, no doubt, joining others in worship with Allah is a great injustice, wrong, indeed, 31.13. Chapter 24, The Signs of a Hypocrite, narrated Abu Hurairah, the Prophet peace be upon him, said, The signs of a hypocrite are three. 1. Whenever he speaks, he tells a lie. 2. Whenever he promises, he always breaks it, his promise. 3. If you trust him, he proves to be dishonest, if you keep something as a trust with him, he will not return it. Narrated Abdullah bin Amr, the Prophet peace be upon him, said, Whoever has the following four characteristics will be a pure hypocrite and whoever has one of the following four characteristics will have one characteristic of hypocrisy unless and until he gives it up. 1. Whenever he is entrusted, he betrays. 2. Whenever he speaks, he tells a lie. 3. Whenever he makes a covenant, he proves treacherous. 4. Whenever he quarrels, he behaves in a very imprudent, evil and insulting manner. Chapter 25 To establish the, nawful, voluntary, prayers on the night of Qadr is a part of faith. Narrated Abu Hira, Allah's messenger peace be upon him, said, Whoever establishes the prayers on the night of Qadr out of sincere faith and hoping to attain Allah's rewards, not to show off, then all his past sins will be forgiven. Chapter 26, Al-Jihad, fighting T and Allah's cause, is a part of faith. Narrated Abu Hira, the Prophet peace be upon him, said, 
the person who participates in holy battles in Allah's cause and nothing compels him to do so except belief in Allah and his apostles will be recompensed by Allah either with a reward or body if he survives or will be admitted to paradise if he is killed in the battle as a martyr had I not found it difficult for my followers then I would not remain behind any Suriya going for jihad and I would have loved to be martyred in Allah's cause and then made alive and then martyred and then made alive and then again martyred in his cause chapter 27 it is a part of faith to establish the nawful voluntary prayers during the nights of Ramadan narrated Abu Hira Allah's messenger peace be upon him said whoever establishes prayers during the nights of Ramadan faithfully out of sincere faith and hoping to attain Allah's rewards not for showing off all his past sins will be forgiven chapter 28 to observe fasting according to Islamic teachings during the month of Ramadan sincerely and faithfully hoping for Allah's reward only is a part of faith narrated Abu Hira Allah's messenger peace be upon him said whoever observes fast during the month of Ramadan out of sincere faith and hoping to attain Allah's rewards then all his past sins will be forgiven chapter 29 religion is very easy narrated Abu Hira the Prophet peace be upon him said religion is very easy and whoever overburdens himself in his religion will not be able to continue in that way so you should not be extremist but try to be near to perfection and receive the good tidings that you will be rewarded and gain strength by worshiping in the mornings the afternoons and during the last hours of the nights see Fath al-Bari page 102 vol 1 chapter 30 the offering of salad prayers is a part of faith narrated al-Bara bin Nazib when the Prophet peace be upon him came to Medina he stayed first with his grandfather's or maternal uncles from Ansar he offered his prayers facing Bajal Maktis Jerusalem for 16 or 17 months but he wished that he could pray facing the Kaaba at Mecca the first prayer which he offered facing the Kaaba was the ASR prayer and the company of some people then one of those who had offered that prayer with him came out and passed by some people in a mosque who were bowing during their prayers facing Jerusalem he said addressing them by Allah I testify that I have prayed with Allah's messenger peace be upon him facing Mecca Kaaba hearing that those people changed their direction towards the Kaaba immediately Jews and the people of the scriptures used to be pleased to see the Prophet peace be upon him facing Jerusalem in prayers but when he changed his direction towards the Kaaba during the prayers they disapproved of it al Baraa added before we changed our direction towards the Kaaba Mecca in prayers some Muslims had died or had been killed and we did not know what to say about them regarding their prayers Allah then revealed and Allah would never make your faith prayers to be lost that is the prayers of those Muslims were valid 2 143